The Big Sleep Out, sponsored by Dreams, is returning to Adams Park on the 26th of November to help fight homelessness in your sleep. The event is organised by the Wickham Homeless Connection Charity. I popped along to their town centre support office to find out more about their work and this year's Big Sleep Out. We are here at Wickham Homeless Connection to try to bring hope and help to people who have lost their homes. And what we need is as many people as possible to take part in our sleep out, to raise funds for our work, and also to raise awareness of the fact that we're here and can help people in a housing crisis. It's on Saturday the 26th of November, and what we're asking people to do is to swap their bed for a sleeping bag, come along, build a shelter in the stand and you'll have an experience just in a very, very small way of what it might be like to not have a home and to be sleeping rough on the street. Now, it's never exactly the same because you know you're going home the next day. There's going to be a hot bath, there's going to be some porridge, you're going to have a Sunday roast probably later on in the day. You've got something nice to go home to. The people we work with who are sleeping on the street at the moment don't have that. Uh, this has happened a few times now at Adams Park. What have been the positive outcomes of, of these uh, events in the past? Oh, we've raised um, well over £50,000 the last few times we've done this, which is an incredible amount of money. We know that people have had an experience that really changes the way they look at homelessness in our community. And um, just by taking part, they, you know, it's a cold, dark, dank night, even though, you know, Adams Park is absolutely lovely. In the middle of the night on a Saturday in November, it can be a bit wet, it can be a bit cold, and it's obviously a hard floor. And people have told us that it's really, really changed the way that they've viewed people who are sleeping rough. And that's what we really need to happen, because it can happen to anyone, it does happen to anyone, and it's only through our communities coming together and providing help and hope that we're going to bring homelessness to an end. You know, sadly, sometimes people can get to the point where the last sort of friendly door is closed on them and they are on their own. Still, people don't just go, all right, I'll just sleep on the street in town. Um, that's when a lot of people say, oh, I'll sleep in my car for a little bit, perhaps, or I could put a tent up somewhere, you know. But it is obviously at this point that people begin to realise this is a really serious issue. Um, and, and they might even begin to think of themselves as homeless. And uh, also, obviously, at that point, it's getting more difficult to keep clean, charge your phone, um, you know, and therefore know what time it is and all manner of things like that. Um, and that is often the point at which people think, right, I'd better get some help. So when people are sleeping rough on the street, they get through clothing. It, it, if you don't have anywhere to wash your clothes regularly, uh, if it's wet, if it's damp, if it's dirty, you know, people get through clothes really, really quickly when they're on the street. So what we've got here is this has all been donated um, by uh, wonderful people who support Wickham Homeless Connection and people who are sleeping rough can come to us uh, our support centre or we, we go out as well so we go out around the whole of South Buckinghamshire and find people who might be sleeping rough and we will make sure that they can get everything they need whether it be coats, uh, underwear, shoes, socks, hats, gloves, scarves, all the things you need and actually we need them all year round. Our charity is here to try and stop that spiralling down as, as early as possible. So if we can stop it right at that point where they were gonna lose their home and we can, we can stop homelessness before it even starts, great. If we can help people who are at the sofa surfing stage or sleeping in their car. Um, but of course, a really big reason why we're here is also to help those people that, that sadly have fallen through all the cracks and have ended up sleeping on our streets here in Wickham, um, in other towns in the south of Buckinghamshire, Chesham. We're, we're here to try and make sure people are connected up with all the right help. But our absolute speciality is getting people housed or stopping people becoming homeless. Those are the two things that if we can do them well, great. <laughs> We love coming to Adams Park because everyone at Wickham Wanderers just really chips in and helps make it a really great event. But coming together at, at Adams Park has made it a really community focused event. You can also always donate to Wickham Homeless Connection. If you don't know anyone who's taking part in the sleep out so you don't, can't sponsor them, then you can still give to the big sleep out online and that will still go into the pot that's going to help us 
meet all the need we need to this winter. Um, and you can always just donate. Everything's on our website. Just search Wickham Homeless Connection and there's loads of different ways to, to give. And that includes food, clothing, sleeping bags. We're always desperate for sleeping bags and, and uh, financial donations are always welcome.